food has been chosen. Bonchon, bonchon. Hello, everybody. Welcome to the annex in SM North. Uh, this isn't going to be the full video, but it's just the the intro to what's really starting. It's the intro to what's really happening tomorrow morning. We are leaving to. Bagiao and uh, gonna take the luxury bus. Oh, ho, ho, luxury bus, sleeper we, bus. <laughs> we've gotten a lot of uh, recommendations what we should do there, and we're leaving early tomorrow. And but before that, we're gonna try what we haven't tried before: banchan chicken. Banchan. I don't. It's up chicken, but I don't know if it, it's not called chicken. Let's go. We've got a spicy deluxe uh, sandwich there that you probably want. I do like chicken sandwiches. There's a lot of options here. We're gonna have to. Sliper, they have crepes? That's very Korean. Oh, yeah, very Korean. You, you're telling me you haven't seen it in any of the K-pop videos? You don't see them just dishing out crepes? All I, the time? I usually don't. They have mandu. Uh, dumplings? Yeah, it looks like they're fried. Oh, okay. All right, so we, we'll have a lot of options to choose from here, so let's see what we can get. What? This food looks very high quality for bon fast food. So, okay, so we're here on Sunday and it's really busy. So like every restaurant is full. Surprisingly, Bonchan isn't that full and this food looks good. What's the deal here? What's up, Bonchan? Oh my gosh, this is hot. And look at this sandwich, holy nuts. I'm pretty excited for this. I'll tell you a little bit more of what our plan is going to Baguio after this epic Bonchan taste test. Bonchan, Bonchan, Bonchan. Oh, that's why the rice is too gelatinous. Ah, true, true. true. It's okay. too wet. That looks like a healthy piece of chicky. The old soy uh, garlico. The breading on this, it's quite, it looks pretty cruncher. It does. That looks like a good piece of chick. How you doing there, buddy chick? Will this be better than Popeyes? This will be our new go-to food panda order, even uh -huh. though we don't order food panda anymore because we're trying to budget. Yeah, we do not go out to eat much anymore. It's pretty crazy. Mm-hmm. That's really tasty. The outside's really crunchy. And you immediately get the soy garlic, and it's not like a layer of it to where it's like you're swallowing the sauce, like a good amount of sauce on the outside. It looks healthily glazed. Mm -hmm. Wow, that's really good. I will say. The rice is very squishy. Oh, <laughs> that is no. the only downside I think I have. That's why this place is empty. <laughs> the rice. But that's tasty. But yours looks very tasty as well. This, this sandwich looks impressive, and so do these fries. I love the double crunch fries like that. They sound yes, cruncher. Yes. yes. Surprisingly, we haven't had many great fries in the Philippines. We haven't. Popeyes has decent ones. Pretty good. McDonald's are McDonald's. They're just like a soggier version. Yeah. These might be the best. Those are so good. These are my favorite kind of fries, like the super crunchy, like double deep fried fries. Yeah, they just have the little things hanging up. Wait, 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 let me give it focus. They just have little like crusties falling off the outside. That's super good. I love this. My new go-to place for fries. This is going to make my hands very messy. There's a lot of sauce on this. So we have some, I think the kimchi coleslaw is on top of this. Oh. We'll see how that tastes in there. It's spicy. We'll see how spicy it does. It's Korean. Yes. We know Korean cool. food can be quite spicy. Here we go. The drippage. Mm. Oh no. Spicy? It's like a really like sharp spice. Oh. This might be very spicy. I should have got a large drink. It's safe. That's really spicy. Oh no. It's burning in the back of my throat. Oh really no. rough. There's a lot of that sauce on there too. I wonder if that's, it's probably that orange sauce, right? Yeah, definitely. There's a lot of that. Okay, it can be killed from drinks. Which, when the spice can't be killed from liquid, is when you know you're in trouble. This is super good. The chicken's really juicy and it's really crispy and the sauce is spicy, but very flavorful. And look at that buttery bun. Yeah, that's a, a nice looking bun. Mm. That's actually really good. I'm impressed. I'm impressed with this. This is a place we've seen everywhere, but we never like, we're really like, oh, let's go here. Yeah, we never, never. Dang, that's really good. Got some more stuff here. We'll uh, get to the mandu later, the dumpers yeah. later, and then. Dun, 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 dun. Maybe we'll finish this up first and we'll move on to the next. Mandu time. Spicy, you'll see how spicy this is. I don't have any. It smells like, it smells like a spicy Buffalo Wild Wing wing. Okay. And look at that. Got some one single ice cube. I'm gonna have to eat both of mine immediately. 
It's not warm anymore. <laughs> it's pretty good. Fried dumper. Usually we're not a big fan of fried dumpers no. compared to a normal dumper. I like a I like a good um, pan fried dumper. Those are uh, my favorite. Ah, yeah. Those just my get that little. It's still soft, but it's got the sear on the outside. Mm -hmm. Mm. It's pretty good. It's a mouthful. I think I would prefer a pan fried. Oh, it's definitely not as good as Filipino booze dumplings. Ah, his but, man do. Yeah. But it's still pretty good. It's a good taste, good flavor. And the spicy sauce isn't that spicy. Nice. Epic. All right, see if you die. I'm uh, going to die. I only feel a little flame on my tongue, the tip of my tongue. Definitely got some spice. Whoa. Ooh. Maybe since I got the bottom one. Or it might just be because I already had the spicy chicken. This is really spicy. <laughs> <laughs> this like whole bottom part's covered and it just covered my entire tongue. It's tasty though. At least you still have half a cup of iced tea. It does wash away pretty easily. It does. Yeah, it's tasty. Yeah. Nothing too special though. No, it's just a dumper. But now something that might be special. Oh my gosh, that looks special. In my heart. I just got spicy sauce on my Yeah, that's what I was just looking at with mine. All my utensils are. This mayonnaise is for the crepe, by the way. Oh, okay. I'll, pour, I'll start pouring it. Okay, please. All right, let's... This looks like a good crepe. It's actually a deep fried crepe, which we've oh. never had before. What the heck? Why is that so spicy? My God. I wonder if I'm used to it or yours had a lot on it. It's, that's where mine was, right there. I don't know. Who knows? That chicken sandwich was really spicy. Oh, wow, it's like strawberry jam inside. Oh. I was not expecting that. It's gonna be like a toaster strudel. Toaster strudel, that tasty. It's like a toaster strudel. Dang, I haven't had a toaster strudel in so long. Without the creamy, no, I guess there was a little bit of cream on there. Yeah, a tiny bit. It was like melted at this point. It's like a not fluffy toaster strudel. Oh. It's like a flat one. That's pretty good. Is that how Korean crepes are gonna be? I didn't know those were a thing, <laughs> Me neither. but uh, I hope so. It tastes pretty good. If you were a real Korea boo, you would eat it with the spicy sauce. And the mayo. And the mayo. And the soy sauce. And ketchup. That's what the, it's all for the crepe. Look at that crunch. Look at That's that. Still your fork. Okay. Look at that crunch, man. The oh. crunch you need. Oh, man. I'm a crunch boy. Yeah, crunch boy, baby. Ooh, we got some jam oozing out the back. We're making crunch boys, baby. Yeah. <laughs> Look at the inside, it even looks like a toaster strudel. It does, it looks exactly like one. Mmm, yeah, that's tasty. The outside's slightly different and more, because it's fried. Mm -hmm. So it has more like that squish to it, or like crunchy squish, but yeah, that's really good. Epic. Bon Chong killing it. Surprisingly good. Surprisingly good. So uh, now it's time for us to go to Baguio. Whoa! Whoa, it's the next morning after Manchon. Oh, oh, waking up and oh no, it's not the next morning. It's actually a couple days later. Wait, totally, we're not going to Baguio? No, we were totally planning to go to Baguio and then suddenly, I. <laughs> but suddenly, the night before we leave, I start feeling a little trembling and then I got sick so we didn't end up going we're gonna go next week when we get back so it's still on the agenda we even had a hotel booked but we're still gonna go next week don't worry things didn't go to plan oh no sometimes things just don't go the way you plan you know you know life comes at you fast you just gotta keep rolling with the punches that's our tragedy in Baguio and now we're gonna go to the grocery store and prepare some epic Filipino snacks for an epic Filipino snack tier list in some video soon. Epic video coming soon. We, you'll get a little sneak piece, peek of the snacks that might be in. Oh, <laughs> epic montage of us going to, actually we're just doing a full grocery store vlog. Just vlogging the daily life of the grocery store. Unfortunately, it's not as cool as our other grocery store vlog during a typhoon. Oh. But it'll be, it'll be cool still. Welcome to SM North, one of the biggest malls in the world. Here's a grocery store. Filipino snack tier list, here we go. I hope everything here is Filipino for sure. Product of the Philippines. Hey, it says Oriental Mindoro, product of the Philippines. 
product of the Philippines, refined sugar. <laughs> this is what the SM North, one of the two grocery stores looks like. I usually go to Trinoma because that one's Same. cleaner. Even though it's like 15 minutes away. Yeah. These are the feed up. Breadsticks. Eggnog cookies. Breadstick. Oh. Nutty bites. Breadstick cheese. I've never seen these ones before. They come in a big pack. Oh. Garlic parmesan. Huh? Oh, I've never seen those before either. Oreo minis. Zest whole root <laughs> That was so delicious. <laughs> oh, tap. Oh, yeah, those are the, the things challenge. they shoved in your mouth. Moby. Moby caramel. Pillows. They're small. Not even big packs. Oh, the ube pillows. Oh. Arabic looking products of the Philippines. Oh, cheesy. Oh, yeah, I got these in uh, Cebu or whatever. Oh. It's gonna be a lot of snacks. V cut. Easy. Uh, oh, yep, here we go. Piatos. Roast beef. I never tried salted potato. They're just like normal, small. Normal kinds to do for V cut. Piatos are not bringing their strong sour cream and onion flavor. Oh, we got roller coaster. Perfect. So, why aren't all of them like that? Uh, 14 cents. I'm assuming all these are Filipino. We didn't like check most of them because we've been here for a while. It seems like. Some of them might be not. It seems like when they're super, super cheap, they are. Yeah. yeah. Prawn crackers, people love those. We gotta get them in there. Yeah, we gotta get them just for the tier list. Sweet and extra hot, normal or spicy? I would think one of the spicy ones would have to fare better for us. So it's not just prawn. Unfortunately, Piatto wasn't repping. They only have roast beef, so hopefully they can make a... Yeah, yeah what the heck to do with that? We have to get the native. Um, cooking things, vinegar and okay, soy sauce, okay. and drink them. I don't think there's anything over there. I don't think so. Here we go. Do you want to build a snowman? Fox Fairies Oval Candy. I like how creative they are with the name Oval, Oval. Candy. Oh, that's a lot of snacks. These are Filipino. Ignore this flag. Not a bad, not a bad pig. Of course, we're going to have miss some stuff missing, so. I'm sorry. Look at all those groceries. Time to go bring them back. Uh, this was uh, seven fifty. Wow, that is a lot of food for seven fifty. You'll see how many snacks it is in the next video or the tearless video. Be ready for that. Oh yeah. Hi.